Research uh, UFO spotting team. They're here to spot any UFOs for this uh, project. Any uh, luck, fellas, uh, finding any UFOs? No, no luck whatsoever. Wait, isn't that one there? Oh, that's just a North Star. How you mistaken? Sorry, folks. We'll come back to them later. And I'm here with Mike Smith, a UFO expert. Mike, could you tell me about uh? your first UFO encounter and what did the spacecraft look like? Well, it was golden, rocket shaped, cylindrical, large. It was amazing. Amazing. So, did you get a look inside of what the beans looked like? Yes, I did. I actually communicated with one of them. He was their leader. Could you tell me that leader's name or what did he look like? His name was That's a close enough pronunciation. That must be um, a different language than ours. Maybe even um, a higher intellect, because I, I couldn't pronounce that. <laughs> yes, most likely. So, if, uh, let's say, suppose, I gave you a piece of clay. Could you construct a figure or a likeness of this being? Yes, I think I might be able to under these circumstances. Well, I do have a piece of clay. Mike, Thank get to work. You. Let me try this here. We need some color variation. Interesting. Okay, here's, here, th this is it. The eyes are not quite as red enough, but the snake is perfect. Zoom in on that, if you will. Disciple of Herman Munster, or just a plain idiot? You decide. We're back here in Griffith Park with our crack research UFO spotting team. Any luck, fellas? No, we've been trying to reach ET all night, but he hasn't been home so far. We have our portable cellular AT&T phone, but no luck yet. <sighs> I just landed about 15 more minutes. With some luck, we'll get one soon. We'll be back. We are now entering the surroundings of a man a named house. Adoy, a witness to a UFO, UFO encounter. Sight. Adoy! Hi! Can we speak to you? Adoy! Ah. We're friendly. Ah. <laughs> they were friendly too. <laughs> They? Who is they? <laughs> you know very well who! Are you talking about the aliens? Like, yes! Where is this? <laughs> what are you doing out here? I'm... <laughs> you like dirt? <laughs> Adoy, could you show us um, where the aliens landed? Right here? And they took you inside a spacecraft? My god. Let's take a close look at this. Take a sample of the soil. Alright. 
So, what were the Martians like? They were 17 feet tall. 17 feet tall? They were pink with yeah. green eyes and red mouths. <laughs> and they, how big was their spaceship? This big. Boy. Landed right here. Flap. Boy, they're very conservative with their space. Yeah. Did they communicate with you? Yeah. What did they say? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> did you understand them? <laughs> Is that a yes? <laughs> yes. Yes. Adoy, what's wrong? Yeah. This is where they landed. Adoy, do you have Thank a you. neck? No. No? They took it. They took <laughs> your they neck? They took my neck! Oh my god. Uh -oh. Adoy, would you like to go inside, or is this your house out here? Uh, this is my house. Yeah. Would you like to go inside? Sure. Okay. Let's go. More with Adoy later. Now back to the UFO sighting team at Griffith Park. We're back here in Griffith Park with our crack research UFO spotting team attempting to contact E.T. once again. Any luck, fellas? Wait, I got through, I got through! Oh, right, uh... Oh, shh. Two large pepperonis and a sausage. Okay. Oh, no luck, no luck yet. Uh, False alarm, guys. I thought I saw one, but it was, it was just a meteorite. Okay. We'll be back. Now back with the primitive-minded Adoy, a man struggling to comprehend the understanding of reality. I had red eyes? Oh yeah, that's what I meant. Sorry. Oh. It was gold and the creatures inside were green with red eyes. Could you expand? I don't think so. No, I don't think so either. Could you add some more um, description about the um, encounter? Yes. Go. 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 Did they touch you? Yes. <laughs> they touched me. <laughs> Could you show us how? Uh, 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 Why? I'm lost about that kind of thing on film. I can tell you more about the ship. It was, it was a big orange ship with, with pink curtains and little yellow men inside with green hats and red eyes. Something like that. Well, that's Bye. interesting. <laughs> Suppose. Suppose. I gave you a piece of clay. Uh-huh. And, um, do you think you could construct the likeness of this being? Probably. Well, hold on. Thank you. <laughs> Like that. Oh my god. Refugee of the Woodstock era? Or just freaked out on acid? You decide. Bark again and, well, our UFO crack research team. There it is! I see it! There it is! No! It. It's over there! It's over here! Right there! No, here! Oh my god. Flash the signals! Take the pictures! It seems as though we've had some luck. Any word from our uh, crack research team on how they feel about their them? Success! Success, my friend! Success. Success! And you've seen it! A UFO sighting on national television. Wow. Think about the ratings! Great. Yeah, yeah. Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! <gasps> Next thing you know, they'll be on Geraldo. <laughs> I wonder if I look sexy with this beard. Claudio sure looks sexy tonight. Why are we sitting here on this couch? I asked for a butt light. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, he's out of here. Hey, come on. 